So this is causing wide range speculation as far as why this is happening or what's going on. The MPT stop number three in Saloon has been postponed. What's up, guys? My name's Kronk. I'm coming to here from the Showdown Saloon in Poker Stars VR, and today we got a lot of stuff to talk about. Before we get into all that, if you like Poker Stars VR, check out my channel. Don't forget to subscribe. If you want to support me even further, you can join my coffee club in the link down below, or consider getting a YouTube membership to my channel. With that out of the way, let's talk about what we got going on. So, about a day ago, someone in the official Poker Stars VR Discord happened to point out, hey, something's wrong with the luxury clutch. The luxury clutch isn't spawning cigars. Isn't it supposed to spawn cigars? So I guess this person had bought the luxury clutch for the first time. If you guys don't know what that is, uh, check out my unlimited cigars video. It's actually my most viewed video of all time. And that'll basically give you the rundown. But uh, it's just a bag. And let me go ahead and pull it out here for you guys. It looks kind of like this. This looks a little different. We'll get into that in a second. But it's basically this bag. You open it up. You can pull out either a cigar, a rubber ducky, or a sandwich cookie. It's completely random. But if you get lucky, you get a few cigars, you know. Anyway, guys, so they pointed out that it was spawning weird items. And I'm going to show you what those items are, because I'm pretty sure it's still spawning. All right, so first thing we pulled out, guys, is a beer can. Now, not too bad, honestly. Like, if they made a item that could pull out beer instead of cigars, I think that'd be pretty cool. And as you can see, you just pop it open, and there you go. So can of beer, not the worst substitute item, but there's more. All right, up next we have this weird little, I don't know what you would call this guy. It's like a guava plant or something like that. But yeah, it's like a little planter, it's pretty small. I'm not sure what that's about, but uh, that's the second item. Let's see if we can get lucky and pull the third item here. Ah, wait a minute. Where'd my camera go? All right, guys, I was trying to do this video all in one take, but unfortunately when I was spawning items, I uh, basically messed up the camera, so that's something that happens. But anyway, as you can see, we have another can of beer, and we have our third item, which is a blank stress ball. So uh, yeah, if you were just now getting your hands on the luxury clutch for the first time in the past couple days, and you're expecting unlimited cigars, unfortunately, it is currently glitched. The team is aware of the issue, and they're working to resolve it. Uh, no set time on when that'll get fixed, but I can imagine it shouldn't take too long. But we got a lot more stuff to talk about. It actually includes the luxury clutch. All right, guys, so out of these five items, four of them normally have something on them that they're missing. Now, if you're familiar with this game, I'm sure you can tell right away what's going on. But if you're not so familiar, there's a lot of missing branding. This microphone, the luxury clutch purse, the stress ball, and even the nail file all used to have Poker Stars or Poker Stars VR branding on them. And now all of a sudden it is missing. So this is causing wide range speculation as far as why this is happening or what's going on. Um, it definitely seems like something that was done intentionally. Like that would be a strange glitch just for those specific assets on all these individual things to disappear. But right now we don't have any official comments on this situation. So until we get official word from someone on the team via the official Poker Stars VR Discord, it's simply speculation, guys. And it is worth noting also, if you can see here, we got the start card, because we're just at a random poker table here. That used to have branding on it. But on the flip side, guys, you can see, here's the blackjack card back. That still has the Poker Stars VR logo, and obviously if you go into the game, it's still listed as Poker Stars VR. It boots up as Poker Stars VR. But because of some of these items here, guys, people are speculating that they might be setting up for a brand change. It'd be very interesting to see what they're going to rebrand to, if that was something that would happen. My guess is uh, Casino One VR, or something like that. The other big thing I wanted to talk about is the MPT stop number three in Saloon has been postponed. Now, if you were playing around back when the first season one MPT was going, you would know that ironically in season one, stop three, the Saloon was postponed then as well. So this is the second time we've hit the Saloon as a stop 
and for some technical reason it's causing the game to basically not function properly causing some instability and for that reason they want to get it fixed before they let the tournaments play out uh, i will say last time this happened guys i was actually in the high roller tournament for the postponed stop three of season one and ended up walking away in second place with over 1.2 billion dollars so that kind of worked out for me uh, maybe it's a lucky charm maybe i'll get some more luck i still plan on entering the ultra high roller i'm not sure exactly when it's going to be rescheduled i assume it's going to fall on a sunday uh last time this happened it was june and july of last year and they just pushed it a week up but i don't want to count my chickens before they hatch this technical problem might take a little more than a few days to fix so we'll wait and see what happens guys Last few things I want to mention, guys, since it is the Lunar New Year event, there is a brand new Lunar New Year casino design. You're definitely going to want to check that out. Uh, they have some videos of it on the official channel, but I definitely recommend hopping in game to see it firsthand. Um, other than that, if you go into your personal suite in the next few days, you'll actually get a red envelope filled with a random prize. I'm assuming it could be chips or credits. I actually got about 3,000 creds out of it. I was surprised. That seemed pretty generous. But uh, again, it could be chips, could be creds, it's all completely random what it is. But you're going to want to log in next few days before it disappears. Other than that, guys, check on the official PokerStars VR Discord. I think they just announced a 2x chip and cred sale. I'm not sure how long that's running. So if you've been thinking about buying chips or creds, you might want to do it now. But that pretty much wraps it up, guys. What do you think is going to happen with PokerStars VR? Do you think they're going to rebrand into something else? Do you think they're going to sell it to a big company? What do you guys expect? Let me know down in the comments. And until next time, guys, I'll see you at the table.